Okay, a parallel plate capacitor consists of two metal plates, each of area 0.6 meter square and separated by a distance of 0.15 cm. Okay, find the capacitance of the capacitor if the space between the two plates is a vacuum or B, an insulator of dielectric constant 2.5. Okay, good. So uh, we want to find capacitance, yeah. Uh, this question wants to find capacitance, right? So uh, given uh, what value, yeah, we have uh, area, yeah. Plate. This is area of one plate. Remember, always take area of one plate, huh? Only take area of one plate. Uh, so he said each, yeah, each has area. Uh, this plate each has area. This one. So yeah, this is correct. Yeah, this is the A, yeah? area A. Already in SI unit, meter square. Separated by distance. So this is the separation between the two plates. So this is the D. Uh, this is the D. But in, remember, this one need to change to SI unit, meter. Uh? Uh, D. So, uh, okay. We have uh, two kind of uh, capacitor here. One, with, one without dielectric, one with dielectric. Okay, maybe I can draw it out. Uh, so for the first one is using vacuum. That means well, all we can say is without dielectric. Uh, without dielectric. That means I can imagine it's just two plates. That's all. Just two plates. Uh, okay, just two plates. Uh, but for question B, uh, question B, he said we have a insulator. The space between them have an insulator. That means uh, has an insulator, or we can say with dielectric. Uh, with dielectric. So uh, between the two plates as a dielectric. That means it has a dielectric in between. Uh, okay. Uh, this is the. Okay, let me label it. Uh, all right. Uh, I have a dial. Have a. Um, okay. This is the dielectric. Oops. This dielectric is an insulator. Yeah, it is an insulator. So the, the charge cannot the charge cannot pass through the dielectric, cannot pass through the insulator. Yeah. Okay, let's do the first one. A. Alright. Uh, so what formula we use? Okay. Uh, vacuum without dielectric. So it's C naught. Uh, e naught A over D. Uh, so which is this one without dielectric is E not A over D. Okay. Uh, com uh, all right. Maybe drag a little bit lower. Okay. If with dielectric, with dielectric, we use this formula. C equal to E A over D. E is E R E not. Okay. This one is using E. Yeah. E. Instead of E not. This one is E. Okay, before we go to that, we go here first. Okay, let's do the first one. Uh. Let's do the first one. Um, okay, do we have uh, the E0? The E0 is permittivity of free space, vacuum, uh, without dielectric. Um, is permittivity, E0 is permittivity of free space. Or we can say the permittivity constant E0. Yeah, 8.85 exponent negative 12. Okay, put that value. Area okay, already in SI unit separation between the two plate separation is uh, 0 0.15 centimeter. So you need to change to meter, Me, uh, centi is negative 2. Okay, uh, centi is negative 2. All right, so calculate. Uh, 8.85 exponent 
negative 12 uh, times 0 0.6 divided by uh, 0 0.15 exponent negative 2 okay so the answer is uh, 3.3.54 exponent negative 9 uh, farad okay is that correct 3.54 yeah, that's correct. 354, negative 9. Alright. Okay, how about the one with dielectric? Uh, the, the insulator with dielectric constant 2.5. So what is this value 2.5? You say this is the uh, dielectric constant. What is mean by dielectric constant? Is it the E? Is it the E? Is the dielectric constant E? No, it's not. It's wrong. Eh? This one is actually dielectric constant. Dielectric constant. Uh, dielectric constant is not E. It's not E. E, and the E is permittivity of dielectric material. E is dielectric, permittivity of dielectric material. It's not dielectric constant. Dielectric constant is just the ER. Okay. Uh, it's just the ER. That's dielectric constant or relative permittivity. The dielectric constant is the ER. So this is actually the ER. Okay? Uh, the ER. It's not E. Uh. Don't you go to substitute. Oh, uh, you take this, this E as, uh, as 2.5. That's wrong. That's wrong. Uh. Don't put this E as 2.5. No. Uh. E is not is not dielectric constant. Uh, dielectric constant is ER. It's not E. Okay. So uh, go back to this formula. If you look at here, uh, uh, this this E is actually this per, uh, this is this E is called the permittivity of dielectric material. Uh, it is actually E is actually ER E naught. Ah. So what we what is given 2.5 is just the ER. Okay? Uh, so ER. ER is the one with 2.5. Uh, this one is correct. This one is correct. Okay? ER is 2.5. Yeah, sometimes we put this, we write this as uh sometimes we write this as K E naught. Uh, it's also K la. Sometimes this is also K. We can write this as K. Huh? We can write this dielectric constant as ER or we can also write it as K. Uh, we can capital K. Yeah? Uh, we can write this as ER or write it as K. Okay? Uh, it's, not, it's not the E itself. Yeah? E is actually ER E naught. So 2.5 is only the ER or the K. Yeah? Not the E. Okay, so uh, we substitute this formula into here. Let's substitute first. So we will have uh, this E R E naught. Yeah, E becomes E R E naught. A over D. Okay, so now, now we have uh, you see, actually here we already calculated uh, E not A over D, right? Uh, e not A over D we did calculated. Is three point five four. Uh, so this one, uh, we already calculated this part, right? Uh, so what I can say is, um, what I can say is, uh, is er this um, e not a over d is actually what is actually this part. This part is. Uh, e not a over d is actually c not. Ah, uh, so you want to calculate c actually is e r c not. Uh, use the uh, dielectric constant, uh, dielectric constant multiplied by c not. You surely get the c already. Okay. Uh, so you don't need to substitute one by one e not. A and D, you don't need to substitute one by one, you just substitute the C naught value you calculated earlier. Okay, uh, so let's calculate. So this is the 2.5 ER, 
2.5 and C0 is uh, 3.54 exponent negative 9 okay let's calculate and see ah so my answer is 8.85 exponent negative 9 farad uh, to 8.85 exponent negative 9 uh, farad okay am i right do i get the, got the answer the correct answer uh b 8.85 negative 9 8.85 negative 9 farad yeah that's correct so that's how we do this question okay um right see you in the next video